very warm welcome to the uh, session. Okay, this is Shweta Roy, your English master teacher at Vedantu. Sorry for this. This is a prose, okay, not a poem. All right. So today we will be dealing with the third session of If I Were You. And why is this part two? It should be part three. Okay, If I Were You by Douglas James. So I hope you have already visited the previous sessions. Uh, where we have dealt with the entire story, the events. So now we will be dealing with the important concepts and major questions and answers from this particular chapter. So let us move ahead with the quote first. Let us begin with the quote. The essence of true education in one's life is to show the presence of mind and heart and soul to sense everything right. Especially we are focusing on the presence of mind in this particular chapter. Okay? So how does Gerard show his intelligence, show his presence of mind, remains calm in a difficult situation? Right? So calm and present patience, calm and presence of mind. These are the three factors that, you know, helped uh, Gerard to save his life and to, you know, outwit the intruder. Right? So let us, well, uh, let us start with the very uh, first uh, topic that is our character sketches. So first we will be dealing with the character sketch of Gerard who is the main character. So definitely you have to talk about what was his occupation. He was a director okay, or actor of plays. So he was a quiet man and he used to be very isolated. He used to keep to himself. right? He uh, did not mingle much with people. Despite that he was an active and wise man who was always you know, calm in even difficult situation, adverse situation. He uses his presence of mind to, you know, come out of the difficult situation. Um, he takes on the intruder with confidence and nonchalance and he uh, <coughs> engages him in his, uh, you know, in conversation. And finally, he, uh, he, he plans, he, um, with his wit, with his intelligence, with his clever plan, he traps the intruder inside um, you know he, he traps the intruder and you have to talk about when you're taking uh, about when, when you're talking about uh, you know one second i'll change the color of the ink so that it's easier for you to okay so when you're talking about you know presence of mind to come out of difficult situation and talking about the intruder give examples here right so uh, how he uh, you know uh, maintains his composure even when he sees uh, the intruder pointing a gun towards him and how he interacts. So please mention uh, his interaction with the intruder. Okay, we will be uh, doing that in the upcoming slides, right? How he converses and what are the... So I'll tell you where exactly, what exactly you can, you know, post, uh, merge in this particular answer. But please do give examples. Otherwise, only giving these points won't help. You have to give examples to show how he showcases his presence of mind and also his calm and composed nature, his patience, right? So next, guys, is uh, the intruder. The intruder is def definitely, he's a dangerous, um, and yes, over here, when Gerard, you know, um, he uh, actually builds up a story saying that he himself is, uh, he himself is on the run, right? So please mention all those points. That point also you have to mention, the story that he weaves, okay? So I'm writing over here the story that he weaves. About what? About the, um, uh, kya tha wo? about the packing that he was doing, right? So talk about that, talk about packing his suitcase, talk about, uh, you know, Escaping the police. Okay, and also, also, uh, you know, uh, also showing as if pretending as if you know the police is right there. The uh, police are right there. They are just now going to come. Okay, so that would uh, make the intruder also panic stricken. So all these are showing his wit and his intelligence. So please give example of that as well. Moving ahead, when we're talking about the intruder, so definitely he wants to impersonate um, Gerard, although he appears to have a plan, but of course he has flaws in his plan. 
right from his actions and dialogues we know that he is not very confident he is a he is kind of shaky which is in complete contrast to the confidence shown by um, gerard right so you can definitely add that point as well okay so he's shaky he's under confident and also he makes the mistake of revealing his plan that is the most terrible mistake that he makes when he reveals his plan so definitely gerard uses it against him right so that is how that is also one point where you know uh, that is also one reason one of the reasons how gerard could outwit him right because he makes the plan he makes the mistake of uh revealing his plan so he was not as sharp as gerard he was not as witty as gerard although he was a dangerous criminal but when it comes to his wit when it comes to his intelligence when it comes to his presence of mind he is definitely lacking that sharpness that gerard had right so you can definitely contrast compare and contrast uh so ultimately he succumbs to gerard's plan and thus it gets caught so here when you're talking about succumbing to gerard's plan please mention the event okay please mention the course of the events that is uh, during you know the entire uh, event which led to his entrapment okay so please mention that event as well so i hope uh, you guys are enjoying the sessions and if you want to study with you know full Uh, you know you if you want to uh, gain full knowledge and 100% marks then what you need to do is just visit the link in the description box and pin comment so as soon as you visit the link guys you uh, you can definitely take the subscription of our platform and you have unlimited live classes with fun and high level quizzes so that is how it is different from the youtube sessions because in youtube sessions we uh, cannot have uh, live classes every time some of the classes are definitely live but some are premiered it's not feasible but so that is why we've solved this problem in our platform guys where we have all the classes live even the quiz questions okay and yes the quiz questions we have in every session which is not there for the youtube platform we have limited quiz sessions menti quiz is the only one which we have right that to in limited sessions but there we have we learn every topic in a fun way with the help of high level quizzes so yes learning with fun is our motto and that is what we follow in our classrooms guys so um you can compete with the students throughout the world so so many students together you learn and you can compete with them and thereby uh, enhance your knowledge your understanding and in case you somehow fail to attend a class let's say due to emergency situation or unavoidable circumstances then you could watch the replays and while watching the replays also you will never feel bored because you have live quizzes even there and the leaderboards are going to appear even there plus you can download the notes at the end of every session specially curated by our master teachers and experts plus we have the doubt solving facility an amazing feature guys we have class teachers at every session in every session guys we will be having class teachers based on the strength of the students to solve to cater to all the doubts that you have in the class live so no more taking up of your doubts piling up of your doubts you will get it solved in the class after each and every session you've got assignment so if you follow that if you solve that assignment what will happen is you will understand how far you've understood the concept which has been done in the class plus we take quality tests which is again going to be of high level so definitely you will be able to understand where you stand right and uh that is going to be a confidence booster for not just your present board exams but also for your future in whatever field you aspire to go plus you get 5000 plus micro courses and crash courses so if you take these micro courses these are chapter wise courses so if you face any difficulty let's say in any chapter you can attend the micro course related to that particular chapter and that is super amazing because that is free no extra amount needs to be paid for 
this mic these micro courses and amazing crash courses now we have less time guys so we have come up with super amazing crash courses which you can avail just for free if you take the subscription it is uh, you know included in that okay so you don't have to pay any extra amount and now the price has reduced guys so uh the link is there in the description box and this is the coupon code if you use this coupon code guys as i told you the price has been reduced and we are right now giving you 50% discount isn't that super amazing guys so the link is right there in the description box 50% discount theek hai so let's see what is the discount price yes it's a very 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 reasonable and affordable amount guys you see per class price 2.5 Okay, two point five rupees per class price. So you, uh, we are there with you throughout, guys, till March twenty one, twenty twenty, twenty twenty one academic year plan. You just need to pay this much, right? If you use the coupon code thousand rupees, fifty percent discount, right? So that is something which you should not miss. Okay. so we are there for you till the end we want to give you the best so that you are not at all uh, lagging behind and you do not face any problem with your education guys right so do not forget to visit the link and this is the coupon code which is now going to give you 50% discount we do not know where uh, till when is this offer okay uh, valid so please don't miss out that is what i can tell you okay do not miss out this amazing opportunity to join us and now we'll get back to the themes of the story which is very very important as i told you already it is uh, definitely emphasizing on intelligence presence of mind and the cool head in the situation of crisis i had been telling you this from the very beginning panic complicates matters but cool temperament can help one wriggle out of the tight corners with ease that is what we have seen right criminals who mastermind most deceitful crimes can also be outwitted because they have a fear of getting detected and caught by the law and this is a point which gerard utilizes right he traps the intruder by out and he outwits him by actually uh playing on this particular point right so tactful planning and handling of a situation can trap even the so called smart criminals although the intruder was not as smart as gerard that we have already seen in the character sketch now when we talk about the significance of the title guys as i told you title is what is the title if i were you so what does it refer to the wishful thinking of the intruder who wants to assume gerard's identity why because he wanted to escape the law so basically when you are writing about gerard uh, uh, when you are like writing about intruder please mention this point in his character sketch as i told you i will be will be doing certain points in the upcoming slides which you would include in the character sketch so i i am telling you here please include this in the character sketch of the intruder that he wanted to assume gerard's identity in order to escape the law and that is in the entire reason of the title being if i were you that is if the intruder is the intruder is uh, thinking to take gerard's identity so it's uh, from his point of view right so the idea of eluding the police by living on a borrowed identity remains unfulfilled because he is trapped by gerard and outwitted his dream to personate gerard is squashed and the if in if i were you looms forever with no hope of becoming a con concrete reality so the title if i were you right the title is if i were you so if is what wishful thinking that means his wish was to take or assume the personality the identity of gerard but it never becomes a reality it is always it is always uh, remaining a wishful thinking till the end right Okay so that was the title and now we will be entering into the important question and answers from this particular chapter so i will be placing the questions and i want answers from you in the chat box guys theek hai so immediately i'll place the answer and i want to response from you the first question gerard talks pleasantly with the intruder was he really pleased to see the criminal 
what do you think so this question will uh, the, the answer to this question would definitely you know be added to the character of gerard so again this would be showing his intelligence right this is showing his intelligence his presence of mind so as i told you in the upcoming slides we will be seeing many points which you can add in the character sketch so please add this as well so i want the answer in the chat box i hope you've all given me your beautiful answers okay so let's check uh so gerard is definitely a clever man he understood that criminal has evil intentions he is very smart so he the moment he sees a man pointing out gun he understands right but what happens is he understood that if he fights or you know if he uh, verbally combats with him then he is not going to gain anything he will be he might be killed he, he can lose his life right so the best way is to calm down okay to talk to him in a friendly manner right so that uh, and even the intruder notes it and he says that he is trying to be calm and careless hai na so by talking pleasantly gerard makes the intruder delay his plan of killing him that was a strategy okay that is another strategy that gerard has so again this would be added in the character sketch showing intelligence right he tells him that he is pleased to see him okay so all these all these would be added when you are talking about their conversation as i told you i have to include the conversation so this is the example that you can give okay so i'm writing over here is example that you can add in the character sketch right so he was not pleased to see the criminal but by engaging the intruder gerard comes to know that he is not an intelligent man because he reveals his plan the intruder reveals his plan so definitely he can take that to his own advantage okay so he knows how to believe behave in a crisis and he is able to lock the intruder in a cupboard and he calls the police all right guys so that was all for the first answer next question why was gerard packing a bag at the beginning of the play how did it help him to outwit and trap the intruder so again this would go this is another example and this can also go in character sketch theek hai so gerard was packing a bag because he had to deliver some props but when the intruder broke into his cottage threatened to kill him he did not lose his composure he did not lose his calm what did he say he spontaneously concocted a story remember i told you the ability to weave stories so here you can weaving stories so this is an example perfect example of weaving stories that you can add in the character sketch right that he himself was a criminal and was trying to dodge the police so this is something which you can add in the character sketch when you are saying that um, he was uh, uh, he he had a special ability of weaving stories acting spontaneously showing his presence of mind so this is how he showed the story was supported by the bag the gun and the disguise the false mustaches etc please add this in the character sketch i'm repeating again and again so this misled this point as well okay he was so convinced that he got ready to escape along with gerald right he did not doubt him okay and then bag definitely played an important role in convincing the intruder that gerard too was criminal like him and he was preparing to flee when he broke the into his cottage next question the intruder's plan was clever but not feasible do you agree yes we of course do agree that it was not feasible on the face of it uh, he planned to kill gerard and assume uh, his identity but it was not feasible why because if gerard had been killed the disposal of his body that could have been, what about the body it's not easy to kill a man right it's not easy to kill someone what uh, how would he have hidden his body right so there are chances that his crimes would have been detected so hiding the body would have been uh, you know not very feasible okay so by chance uh, he would have managed to deal with this let's say he had hidden this body suspicions would have risen in the mind of his theatrical clients of course he was a man of theater so he would have people 
you know although he remained isolated but of course he had clients so then he had a workplace he had his colleagues so that would create a you know uh, uh, that would create suspicion okay and hence these were you know certain loopholes in his plan okay moving ahead presence of mind the most important and the theme based question this is also the theme guys theme of the lesson okay uh, are two values that a person at the time of adversity and danger how did these two attributes of gerard help him get rid of the intruder okay so this is something which which can completely go in the character sketch as well so very easy uh, gerard's cool temper allowed him to concoct the story to make a story to weave a story and finally you know he was able to save himself from the intruder he used the weapon of his wit and patience okay and it is rightly said so when you are actually talking about all this please include examples we have done examples from the previous slide okay we have done the examples in the previous slide when we were talking about how he engaged the uh, intruder into a conversation so that you know he is is also revealing his plan at the same time he is uh, delaying his uh, killing okay so all those points which we have done in the previous slides please do include that as well and this would serve as a good introduction and conclusion but in the body you have to give examples okay which we have already done so i have not separately taken here so that is all guys that were uh, these were the most important questions from this particular chapter i hope your concepts from this particular play is absolutely clear sorry story yeah this was a play sorry the uh, this particular play is absolutely clear and if you still have got any other doubts then please do let us know in the comment section and this is the homework question do solve the homework question in the comment section guys do you think the intruder was smarter than gerard why or why not which quality of gerard made him smarter than the intruder you see that all the questions are basically the answers are same basically it's on harping on the theme of intelligence and presence of mind and example how can you say what are the examples that you see which shows his presence and intelligence of mind all right so these are some points i mean th these are th this is the theme uh, and uh, the questions are going to revolve around this particular topic so guys uh, it's very easy you can you can uh, frame this answer on your own only the introduction and the conclusion would be changed right so thank you guys uh, don't forget to click the link click on or visit the link in the description box and pin comment use the coupon code swrpro don't forget that and if you have liked the video guys don't forget to like hit the like button share the video amongst your friends subscribe to the channel in case you haven't thank you so much guys take care bye bye see you very soon in the next session